What's going on guys and welcome to a brand new video. For me right now, it's currently just after um, 3 o'clock in the morning. Uh, I've just got done watching the Game Awards uh, and I recorded my whole reaction to the actual events. Uh, so I thought I'll throw a few videos out today and this is the first one which is called Exodus. Uh, so hopefully you enjoy past me reaction to the game uh, and just um, like initial thoughts. So enjoy the video. It's an incredible thrill to introduce a true renaissance man. Please welcome Academy Award winning actor and New York Times best-selling author, Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. <laughs> How are we doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, what have you got for us, Matthew? Thank you all for having me. What have you got for us? Good to be here. What's up, everybody? Good to be here with you at the Game Awards. Wait, has Matthew McConaughey ever been in the game out, before? I was going to say the line that has preceded me on my career. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> but they told me. They said, no, no, I no. I always get him mixed up Don't with, do uh, Come out and say, is it Michael Fassbender? Pew, pew, pew. Oh, my God. All right, we'll see how He's that, so how crazy. That, how that handled. I'm here tonight because I have a world premiere for you from Austin's own Archetype Entertainment. Oh, Austin. I'm also here tonight because the video game that I'm premiering is the first ever video game that I'm a yeah, part of. I thought it was me. I thought it would be the first game. Hey. When the Archetype team first reached out to me, I was excited about Archetype. becoming a part of the gaming world. But what really turned me on the was studio when doesn't they ring a bell. the game's vision and my role in it. I will be voicing a character in this game, and all I can say is that I will have a unique relationship with every player. In this <laughs> game, time moves differently. Days for you are decades for your loved ones back home. Some sci-fi game. Choices gaming. that you make not only affect the people that you love, they'll also affect your entire civilization for generations to come. Now, personally, I have had some experience with time dilation. <laughs> and now you can too. Good damn it. So now I am proud to share the first ever look at Exodus. Exodus. So 100% the space name straight, whoa, straight off the bat. What studio was it again? Arkwright? Max. Wasn't there the guys? Are, isn't that some oh, people that's getting from getting the Mass Effects? Saga, who developed some of the Mass Effect games. Archetype, sorry. The yes, yeah, it is. What Archetype is ex was a miracle. Mass Effect developers. It would be Whoa. our salvation to fight against the Celestials, humanity's greatest enemy. Hello. This is it. They it found us. If this is a possible third person over the shoulder shooter with an epic story. The Celestials hunted us down. I knew they'd keep chasing us until they ripped our ship apart. And I had to save her. I led them away from this world, away from her. We both knew the cost of using the gates. When you travel at light speed, time slows to a crawl. It was only days for me, what but an years. entire lifetime yeah. passed for her. And in the chaos of those final moments, we never said goodbye. No, come with me! Wait! Please! Tom! This has a lot of potential. If we see gameplay right now... Whoa. Our service, our sacrifice, discovers worlds, seeds hope, breaks empires. We are the travelers. I've been, I've been dying for some, like, new massive... <gasps> We have got gameplay. Pre-alpha gameplay, by the way. Become the Traveler. PS5, Xbox Series S, PC game. Oh my God. So that trailer looked pretty insane. Exodus. 
it could definitely be rivaling like Mass Effect. And I think a lot of people are going to compare it to Mass Effect. One, because it's by some ex-developers of Mass Effect. And I think if it's done right, and by the look of them CGI trailers, if that's what gonna, it's going to be like in-game with that gameplay, this has potential to be a pretty decent series over the next 10 years.